Welcome, this is Paula Chafee Scardamalia of DivinningTheMuse.com with your three card tarot reading for your creativity and your creative work for today, Thursday, May 10th. Okay, your focus card for today is the King of Coins. Coins has anything to do in the material realm, um, money of course, home, health, anything you can touch, taste, or feel. You can see the king standing here on the balcony. See how he's holding the coin very comfortably, very relaxed as he looks out over his realm. Your focus for today is to take that same attitude. Um, it's about understanding how you hold your resources, what's the big picture for how you use them, how you send them out, and how they come back. So you want to be the king today and get the big picture. Because your action for today we have the five of coins and of course as I've said before the five is always a challenging number in any of the suits you can see the poor woman sitting here with her alms cup held out behind her though is this beautiful window it looks like it might be a window of a church or a chapel or some sacred space and all this light pouring down on her that she's just not and the flowers and everything that she's just not paying attention to so your action for today is to stop looking for the income or the assistance in your usual place if you've been trying to make something happen and make a sale of your art or your book or your creative product and it's just not coming then stand up and turn around and look and see if it's actually uh, coming from a different direction and then finally, your gift for today is the Eight of Cups. And this kind of relates to what the earlier card. Um, you can see the sign here of Pisces and on the moon. You know, this is the, the man here is looking towards the big dream. But underneath the water, he's got the legs, the eight legs of an octopus and the eight cups here. And what he has to do is be willing to let go of those cups so that he can move forward to the dream. So your gift for today is an opportunity to let go of what no longer holds fulfillment, creative fulfillment for you, so that you can move towards the big vision. So as we look at the story for today, you know, get the big picture on how was money coming in and where is it going out? How do you, what is it that you want to create so that you've got some of that financial stability? Then look today, get up, turn around and look for other ways of creating that instead of waiting for the old one to pay off. And then finally, it means letting go of some of those, looking that moment coming, that gift coming where you can let go of some of that old stuff and head towards the new dream. And this is Paula Chafee Scardamalia of DivinningTheMuse.com. Wishing you divine musings.